Let me ask you this. At what point do you draft a quarterback of the future? Uh, Zach Wilson obviously did not work out. You have a 40-year-old coming off an Achilles injury, as you talked about. I believe they signed Tyrod Taylor this offseason to be the backup. Uh, Where's your quarterback of the future? You have to address this at some point, don't you? Like, I mean, I don't... This is a pretty quarterback deep draft. A lot of these guys are going to go in top 11. Uh, You're probably not going to get one of those guys. But at what point do you say, we need to draft Aaron Rodgers' replacement? He ain't going to be around here that long. We don't even know if he's going to be good this year coming off that Achilles. They're committed now. And so here's the thing. It's not a mistake if they won a Super Bowl last year. It's not a mistake if they win a Super Bowl this year. Because if you win a Super Bowl for the next five years when you suck, you can look at your fans and say, yeah, but we brought you the Lombardi Trophy. The problem is I don't think that they're a Super Bowl caliber team. And I think we're just taking for granted that this this concept that he's going to come back, he being Aaron Rodgers, is going to come back and be perfectly healthy. I don't think that's realistic. So I don't have any belief in the Jets. So what they're going to end up with is realizing that they threw a bunch of money at a team that almost like a bad remodel. They ran out of money after the kitchen and now the rest of the house is just in shambles and they're going to have to get it all the way down to the studs and rebuild it from scratch. And your team right now is not better than the Buffalo Bills. Your team right now is not better than the Kansas City Chiefs. Your team right now is not better than most of the elite. I wouldn't take the Jets as a playoff team today. If they make the playoffs, fine. But let me ask you this. Was all of this worth it for the playoffs? Was it worth it for one and done in the playoffs? because your team's going to suck for a long time after you have to rip this thing apart and you never address the future. That's the problem the Jets are in. Look, they went all in on a a four-time MVP quarterback who blew his Achilles out four places. Like, you can't predict that. Like, it's it's tough for me to sit there and say, but but to your point, like, there was risk involved in a 39-year-old quarterback last year.